was but he always said, if I go first to range, just tap me to tip. <laughs> What I six, uh, got a job for you. It's an 89 year old female. Uh, she has gone unconscious, fallen while obviously being unconscious, and seems to have done something to her shoulder. Hello, lovely. My name's Jared. What's your name? It's Doreen. Hello, Doreen. Do you know how long Doreen lost consciousness for, lovely? Uh, just, oh, I would say about 20, 30 seconds. Not very long. No. Well, let's have a go on the gas now, because you'll have to bring your shoulder up. That's it. Have you? Nice deep breath. <laughs> Imagine, as if you're sucking through a straw. You've got to breathe out, though. <laughs> That's really important. Should we try and get this top off? OK. <laughs> so, yeah, go on, give her a hand. We'll get this straw. There we go. Relax your shoulders best you can. Just want to look right into the side. There's no obvious drop or anything. My humour is That's why I'm laughing, you see. We're going to pop your sling on, Dory. What's the service that's been going on today? We're all in the Mother's Union at church. Right, okay. We've come from Lancaster. We all get together every now and again at different churches. Yeah. Is that comfortable there? Yes, it is. Does that feel better supported, Doreen? It does. Thank Relax. you. My pleasure. Thank you very much. We need an X-ray on this arm. Right. Is that all right? Oh, thank you. No, it's our pleasure, sweetheart. Yeah, especially all that you're going through, you deserve it. No, thank you, sweet. We need the NHS as well. Yeah. What will you do? You were there for my Please don't, they've got enough to No, do. bless you. It's why, it's why we're here, it's why I joined, it's why he joined. It's coming to fabulous people like yourself and get you sorted. I always put everything down to my age, you know. <laughs> well, the thing was, I'm, I lost my mum when she was only in her early, mid-50s. Oh, sweet. And then was my husband was 77, my dad was 77. OK. And I was no, always known as the creaking gate because of my health problems. Really? And yet, I'm the only one still here. I've lived them all. I'm tormenting everybody. There's no room for me <laughs> up there yet. <laughs> have you always found your faith quite comforting? Yeah, yes, it's a lot of people's but You have. He always said, if I go first to range, just take me to tip. <laughs> I bet you're both a right laugh together. You've got out and stuff well, like I keep that. telling them I'm not ready to join him. No. I will, I will one day. Yeah. When there's room, he'll, he'll call for us. He's with me all the time anyway. Yeah. Oh, dear. You don't realise what you've got till you've lost it. I think what makes the NHS is the people who are in the NHS. Because we want to help not only our relatives, not only our friends, but everyone's mum and dads, everyone's grandparents. Born into the NHS, it's something I will always assume will be there to provide care for myself, my family members. Apple 196. 196, go ahead. Just wondering how everything went. She was absolutely fabulous. She went to go hug a friend who sadly just had a loss. And that's when we think she's injured uh, the top of her arm. Did feel sorry for her, because when the injury had happened, um, she was like, no, no, don't call them. They're there for genuine emergencies and they're striking. These old people need us. They're not calling us, which is a bit sad. Mm -hmm. 